We're backstage with the lovely Janelle. So I gotta ask you, they just announced tomorrow it's Carrie Underwood. You excited? I am so excited. I've not been able to meet Carrie Underwood and I want to meet her tomorrow. Yes. I want to meet her. Sometimes we don't get to meet the, the special guest. Oh, you're gonna meet Carrie. I, ha I have to, I have to. <laughs> I have to get a picture. I wanna get a picture with her. Absolutely. So let's talk about tonight. Um, when you guys, when you're watching the packages back about how everybody's like imitating you stuff, when you saw that, were you like, that's not me or is it really you? You know what, I was mainly trying to not focus on on that because um I was afraid I'd, I'd like start laughing and stuff yeah. and uh I'd mainly try to not think about it because I needed to focus on my first lyrics. Yeah, yes, absolutely. Know? So they, the two things they said about you is that your accent, obviously, but they said you're always like emotional and dramatic. Do you agree with that? Like, I think that they talk about my facials and like that I'm really passionate, like when I talk, and it's so true. It's so true. I, and it's like so funny because I mean, Brunel's the one that pointed it out, and I. And I mean, I know that about myself, but then it got everybody started on it. So like every time I talk, they're like, oh my gosh, I'll be chuckling, you know, over in the corner because I'm talking so dramatically. <laughs> and uh, last row said that you'd be like in the fields with a corn. What is something, since you've been out here in LA though, that you're like, LA does it way different than the country. I don't get how they don't do it like a... I don't know. Maybe, um, oh, I don't know. Maybe just the... Uh, the smiles or something I'm you know you're used to people friendly people down in the south I mean really I know and it's like it's still a great place I'm not I don't have a problem with it I just think that definitely it's a different way of life out here and uh, I do love the southern hospitality of it all so how did you feel about the the group performance and your solo performance tonight I felt great about both of them and um I mean, of course, like I was, I thought, how am I going to get through this solo because I had something stuck in my throat the whole time. <laughs> but I was like, I said, okay, it's rock week. I'm going to use it as gravel, make it sound yeah. like that. Like that's what I was going for. But um, I was so happy that, you know, the judges actually liked it. And that, yeah. that meant a lot to me. And then uh, we were really happy that we got through that group number because yeah. we learned it yesterday. Yeah. So we were really, you know, yeah, glad that we minute. got through. Yeah. yeah, last minute. Um, lastly, what did you take from Rock Week? Like, is there something, because, you know, the rocker chicks, I mean, you got they do the hair, they do, you had Orianti, who was with Michael. I mean, tell me a little bit what you're going to take next week so that we're going to see a little bit of that rock side. Um, yeah, oh, gosh. Um, next week, I don't know what I'm going to do. I mean, I'm just going to probably make a song selection that really shows off just um, more so my style of music because of course this was a theme that's yeah. that's not typically what I would do I just did I just did my own country thing with it and uh, thanks to Billy Joel for writing a great song and uh, performing it and I really was happy I got to do that tonight All right, well, good luck tomorrow with Carrie thank you so much All right, take care.